Nathan Drew and we're here at 2022 Junior Worlds at Goodfield Park and I'm here to show you what's in my bag. So we're going to start off with the putting putters. I put both of these are putting approach JVRs. This one is much heavier. It can ha handle some headwinds and I use this for shorter putts like from inside 30 feet. And from outside 30 feet I use this light blue AVR for longer putts and jump putts and maybe some backhand approaches. Now my forehand approach putters are, first one is an AVR3, it's pretty dead straight and I, so usually when I throw this I'm using it straight at the basket or I might even give it a little run. And I can throw this pretty much from like 100 to like 130 maybe. And this is just more of an overstable model of that. Um, I can use it in headwinds and I know it'll curl back if I put it wide. So now we're moving on to the mid ranges. I got three in the bag right now. So this is a Team Innovo stamp Lion and this is just like, if I put it straight, it'll go straight for a while and then come back. It's like, I can use it for like 150 feet, maybe 160. I don't usually use it though. Now, this mid range is like if I put it on a hyzer, it'll this is a skx skeeter. If I put it on a hyzer, it'll like flip it to flat, and if I put it straight, it'll stay on that line. And it's just it's really it's really nice for like flip ups and straight lines. It's I can use it as a tunnel disc. And this is a DX Innova Team Innova Gator. Um, this is my overstable mid-range, it's my main mid-range too. Um, it's pretty overstable, so whenever I approach with it, I have to hang it out wide and let it curl back. And I can use it from pretty much like 150 to like 160. Now moving on to the fairway drivers. Now, let's start from understable to overstable. a backhand disc this is more of a utility disc because if i put if i throw this into a headwind and i throw it flat it'll like turn into a roller and it's just so understable that sometimes i can't even use it so this i don't this is mostly for backhands because if i throw it on a forehand it'll turn over and roll away so i don't use that too much for backhand either but um this is a d-line fb um this is probably my main fairway driver. It's like dead straight. It's it's maybe like a straight, uh, a faster version of the Skeeter. Um, but yeah, I can maybe throw this up to like 170 to like 200. Um, and it just goes dead straight. Um, these, these are Leopard 3s. This is this team in a stamp DX Leopard 3 is just a tad more overstable than this. I don't really use it much, but if I need a little fade at the end, I'll probably use this. And this is just pretty much a backup of that, so I don't really use it, but yeah, it's just pretty much a backup of this. Now this is a TO3. This is a little bit more overstable than this. Like this, I can hang it out wide and it's going to come back and curl around at the basket. I use this for pretty much like like 160 or 170, 175 maybe. And this is just an overstable DX Firebird. I use this for headwinds and stuff where I need to curl around and have it use stuff. And these, and last but not least, we're going on to my distance drivers. We're doing it understable to overstable. have this dyed star boss um this is pretty understable i can put it flat and it's going to turn over and then after a while it might come back i can probably throw this 200 maybe 215 i really like this disc and this is probably my main distance driver it's a starlight boss and i can put this one flat and it'll stay on that line and then maybe turn and hyzer back um 
I can throw this, this is probably my max distance and I can probably throw it like up to like 230, 240. This is a little bit more of a stable than that. It's when it's in a headwind and I still need to get some distance, I'll probably use this Pro Wraith. It's a little bit more of a stable than that star, Starlight Fox. And this pink, pink F2 Factory Wraith is more of a stable than this one. It's pretty much just a backup of that one and maybe when this Wraith isn't as um, is too understable. Maybe I'll use this one. And this is just my overstable dis distance driver. It's just like if it's like headwind or I need to like really put a heavy flex on something and know it's going to come back, I'll use this disc. It's a Ricky Wysocki Star Destroyer. And up in here I have a chalk bag. And I pretty much, um, I use it at Junior Worlds a lot, and I pretty much only use it when my hands are sweaty, and it's really useful. And you know, you got towel, and your discs are wet. And, yeah, that's pretty much it. Um, I hope you enjoyed this video, and see you next one. Keep dreaming. Peace. <laughs>